let's say there is a circle of radius. If I want to draw a tangent from this point, P, you have a circle of x radius and you have to draw a tangent from point P. So what can I do? I'll join O to P and I'll extend the line. I take O to P, cut on the other side, that is Q, and then I'll bisect. Okay, so that is a tangent of a circle at point P. So this radius, this distance equals to this distance. Now, if they will ask you to draw a tangent from a point which is outside the circle, let's say this is point R, and we want to draw a tangent to this circle. So what we will do? First, we will join O to R bisect O to R, write that point as S, we take S to O and draw R. So wherever it is touching, that is point D1 and T2. So R to T1 and R to T2. We have two more tangents, that is external tangent and internal tangent. So now external tangent, they will give you two radius. So bigger, bigger circle is of radius 30 and the small circle is of radius 20. We draw two circles. Now I want to draw external tangent. That's called direct common tangent. Now in this case what we will do? First we will bisect AB. We will draw circle O to A. This is called mid circle. Now external tangent. So in that tangent, what we will do? This is our radius 30, 20. So what is the difference between these two circles? Uh, radius is 30 minus 20 is 10. So we will take 10. And we draw this inside the bigger circle. Why difference? Because if you see D, D is direct common tangent. So if you want to remember, you can remember this D as deduct. That means 30 minus 20. So it will be 10. At this point is M. Take A to M. Now draw a line passing through M. Wherever it will cut, that is point T1. Now draw a parallel line. You know how to draw parallel line. Wherever it will cut, that is point T2. So now join T1 to T2. So that is your external tangent. Now we will draw internal tangent. Now internal tangent line. What we have to do? Same method. We will take the same dimension. We will take the radius 30. Again bisect. Draw a circle, take O to A, draw mid circle, inner tangent. That is TCT, transverse common tangent. Now, in this case, now when we were doing external tangent, that time it was uh, the name is direct common tangent. At that time we have taken D. D means deduct. Now in this case we what we will take internal tangent. So it is transverse common tangent. So in that T means total. So we will take 30 plus 20. It will be how much? 50. So we will take 50 per radius. 
and we will draw outside the bigger circle. Now wherever it will intersect, that is point M. Now again we join A to M and we draw parallel and draw a line passing through B wherever it will cut. This point that is T2 and this point is T2. Join D1 T2. So that is internal tangent. So this is external tangent and this is internal tangent. 